Hello everyone, I'm TheGamerBear76 and this is my 40th ever video. And welcome to a video that isn't what I promised. I'm painting on this popcorn bin. Cool. It has fabric paint in it right now, but that's not going to be in it while I'm painting on it. To sanding. Go. The TheGamerBear76. for death. I tried to start sanding it here, and then I realized I need a mask. Duh. I got my mask, I'm ready to go. Uh, now it's time to start sanding. I'm sanding, I'm sanding. Oh, and uh, the red was coming off and it went on my fingers. Okay. The bottom, I'm gonna not sand that because I don't feel like painting it. And that was such a cool transition. Anyways, um, I don't know why I stood there for so long. <laughs> I'm painting on a weight vice coat with this big brush. I did about this much, and then I realized this. This huge paintbrush is not gonna work. I just shoved it in there. Yeah, that did stay there the whole time, which was about two days. And then I did the rest of the base coat with this littler brush, but it's not that huge. It's not that small. And that's gonna take a long time, so I'm just gonna skip through and be there later. Oh wow, the base coat's done. Wow, you can barely see anything. And uh, I did the other side too, but um, we're not doing that one right now. We're doing this side first. Don't forget it. <sighs> I'm out of breath. I'm going to sketch. I was really worried the sketch was gonna look bad. It was gonna, gonna look like a dog. Well, let me explain my reasoning to make a dog. It's because I say puppy paint, puppy paint, and I wanted to draw a puppy playing in paint, so I'm drawing a puppy jumping in the paint. Well, it's not really a puppy, it's a full-grown dog, still. And like, here I'm like, oh thank god it actually looks like a dog. Or thank dog, I should say. Yeah, I don't really know where most, how to find most sound effects, so I just do them myself. Anyways, uh, I don't know why I just stood there for a second, I fixed that eye, and enter acrylic paint. Not that side, this side. Okay, okay. That was a weird way to say that. Now it's time to make some paint. Ignore how my palette's so dirty, uh, I don't feel like I'm washing it off. These are the three paint colors I'm going to mix together. Brown, lighter brown, and white. Let me just pour some of this into the palette, yeah. And then this one had a little bit of a unmixed paint goo, so I didn't feel like scooping that out and trying to redo it, so I just added some goodly shaken up stuff on top and hope that fixed that cancel it out, which it did. It did pretty well, actually. Time to paint. sped it up because yeah I don't feel like I'm sitting here all day. Um yeah and painting a dog on a box and he's about to jump into some paint. That's pretty cool, right? And here's his paint color, which is turquoise. Also this paint I found in a house my grandparents recently bought and I don't know what this means but somewhere on it it said 2016 so it's pretty old. Um, just to give you an idea, my brother, my youngest brother was three when that, in 2016, he's ten now. And now here's some pink! I'm gonna do his nose in the pink. Yeah. This is taking a while. His nose in the pink, and don't worry, that is not the only time he will be seeing pink today. No. -uh. Here's some black for the outline. Pour some of that. And start doing the outline. Yeah, I'm outlining this dog playing in paint. Also, the reason I drew the paws in kind of a triangle is because my dog was close by and I decided to use her paws as reference. And now it's time to paint the paint. Wow, that's the first time I'm saying that. Well, yeah, I guess. And uh, that's it for this side, so whoa! There's a 
sketch here. And uh, there is no white base coat, so this sketch didn't stick very well. Oh, and I forgot the paint puddle, so that's me drawing it there. And uh, I'm using the exact same colors. And while I was painting this, I realized this is pretty much just fox and, but like, not orange. So I chose her color to be orange. Also, all their eye color is the same as the color of the paint. Just pointing that out. Maybe I'll make this one a squishy one day. Yeah. Foxanne. This is, she's pretty much the opposite of Foxanne. So her name's Roxanne. Because it's a similar name. I don't know what else to say. This line out will go by pretty quickly. Watch. See? Really fast. And um, the Foxanne is a squishy. And speaking of squishies, I have a bunch of squishies recently. Here's a picture. So please tell me which ones, or one, you would like to see me paint on, if you're still here. Anyone? Anyone? Anyways, I'm... Don't know what I'm doing with Roxanne right now. Yeah, I think that's what her name was. That's definitely what her name is, I don't know if I said that right. Now I'm painting her orange paint. The paint. And, uh, yeah, I did a few close of this off screen and I did have to paint the entire back white anyways so because I messed up some stuff right there you see right next to her on the right yeah so yeah here it is after I painted more white on top and here's another one here's another dog this one's eating the paint do not eat paint this one is oh yeah I'm just mixing the paint <laughs> wow I'm just not talking okay I added some orange and a few colors to it. I don't know what I'm doing. Trying it on, yeah. And here I am painting him. And I'm, his name is Charles. Yeah, I just decided his name's Charles. Well, I didn't just decide that. Just He looks like a Charles. And do not eat paint. This is edible paint. But it's still paint. Uh, yeah. Don't eat paint. It's probably not edible. This is in a magical world where nothing will happen to Charles. So don't worry about him. And this one, and he has a little tongue, well not, well that's how he's eating it though, because that's what dogs do, and why did I slow down this clip? <laughs> oh, it's because I'm painting with the, oh yeah, I was painting, started painting with paint, and then I realized, oh wait, I'm not finished with the line, so I went back to that, and yeah, just lining Charles some more. And you might notice the chunk missing out of his back. Well, that's because he got paint on him. He was laying in it, I guess. And then he decided, wait, this is really yummy. Let me get a taste. So he started tasting it. And he really liked it. Yeah. If he was laying in it, why is there no paint on his head? It did not add any paint on his head. Because I just decided he was laying in it. And that wasn't in, on my mind while I was painting. I just decided to have that there. That spot of paint there. Yeah, now I'm painting that spot, and I am filling in his paint puddle, which is green. I think this one might be one of my favorites. Um, maybe just because it's green, and green is my favorite color, is color. but maybe it's because he's a fat dog eating paint. I love eating, so maybe I just, I have a deep connection with Charles. Not really that deep. I just decided to say that just would be funny, I guess. I'm done with Charles for now, so here's a sleeping cat. So yes, there's two cats, two dogs. This one actually has a white base coat this time. Base coat? Did I say base coat? It actually has a white base coat this time. Yes, uh, and I'm making a lighter color that was Charles, and I added yellow to it, and boom. Uh, this is actually the color that I originally wanted Biscuit to be. You know, my cat in a cup is an orange theme. Yeah. And that's all. There we go. Paint, wow. And yeah, that's it. Her name is Cookie, because Cookie is what the British call biscuits. Time for the juicy highlights. And here's his highlights. His name is Bluey, because he's jumping into blue paint. He might be my least favorite. Shh, don't tell him. And here I am doing the tiny little highlights. Here's Roxanne's highlights. Uh, what is that in the frame? Oh, hey, you can actually see what I'm watching. Uh, here's Charles' highlights. 
highlights. Did I say churros? Yes. And here's Cookie's highlights. Yeah. Oh, I, oh, I almost forgot her nose highlight. And here I am applying Mod Podge and... And it's done. Um, sorry about that annoying holding the and thing. And I can't, I can't decide if this one's my favorite or this one's my favorite, Charles or R Roxanne. Anyways, I'm gonna put Charles on the front right now. I hope you enjoyed me painting on that. And if it's your birthday, happy birthday and goodbye.